Crete's located 30 minutes south of downtown Chicago. One of our biggest threats preparedness wise is severe weather, severe thunderstorms, tornadic events, high wind events that take down power lines. Last summer we had a tornadic outbreak and most of the town was out for about a week. Crete EMA is primarily responsible for disaster preparedness. For that event, we were manning the emergency operations center with some of our other departments. The fire department came in, public works came in, and we were in communications with the police department. We had a power outage. All of our radio and network equipment was down for half a week, if not a week. We were initially scrambling to get some alternative power sources, keep our phones up, our internet access, and then even just the regular two-way radios rely on power to stay on. We have a lot of specialty equipment. Behind me is our rehab unit. We also have some snowmobiles for winter weather responses. So your initial reaction to when you lose power is what are we gonna do next? What's our response? How do we keep operating so we can protect our people and serve our community? Jackery, they very graciously donated us a smart switch and a Jackery 5000 unit. Awesome, thank you. We had Jennings Electric come in and install it. The installation process today was very fast. An hour and a half is pretty fast for an install. And normally like a generator system, it's you know five to eight hours depending on the size in the house. This was really fast and easy to install. Everything is laid out. Most of it is pretty internally wired. So I just simply had to swap a breaker out and put a wire in between. On one power unit, it can stack 10 batteries per unit. So yeah, no, that's, uh, that's a pretty decent amount of power to have on backup. I like the fact that the battery generator is movable. If somebody's house is out of power, you can bring it to them and keep the refrigerator running. Your grid white light will go off. It means you lost power to your grid. Your output wattage is what it's pushing out. Okay. Thank you for coming out today. No problem. We got our emergency operations room lights on, receptacles, office lights, and our north garage door so we can get uh, some of our emergency equipment out. Today, we enabled the UPS mode. The UPS keeps your computers from actually rebooting when the power goes out. All the computers should stay online, and then the radio should stay online as well. Three, two, one. Our two emergency operations rooms are online. All of our radios stayed online and our phones stayed online. So our grid light is off, so it looks like we did lose power. The jackery is putting out off the battery, so we are remaining powered on. All of our key emergency equipment stayed online and powered on without even missing a beat. Even with computer screens, TVs, two-way radio equipment, LED lights, none of it flickered at all. We were on immediately. The Jackery 5000 has a maximum output of 5,000 continuo watts, peaks at 7,200. It's got a lot of great features and specs, a lot of different modes you can operate in depending on your specific situation. The Jackery Smart App seems very user-friendly. It's smooth. With the units connected to Wi-Fi, I can pull up the app and I can look to make sure the unit's getting power or sending power. I can be anywhere in the world and pull up the app and be able to make sure it's doing what we need it to do. It's nice that it has the featured peak and off-peak hours. It could save somebody quite a bit of money if you can set it up to charge during those off-peak hours. And it does take a charge very quickly. Our unit charged in a little under two hours from zero to 100. The Jackery is eco-friendly with the solar panels that you can add on. You're generating your own power into your own battery, so you're kind of self-sufficient and self-reliant. In the upcoming months, we'll be very well prepared to respond to any disasters or emergencies that come our way. It's astronomical the amount this is going to help us out. I think the community will be a lot safer with this equipment. Mm -hmm.